got a bunch of fangs right here. It's like a mouth. Check it out, this is pretty cool. I'm underneath some broken stalactites and drapes. I'm gonna go slow so you can see the uh, rings and formations of the cross section. Check it out, even mix them with some cave algae. That is cool. Hi everybody, Anthony here, and thanks for watching Crystal Minor Rocks. We're talking caves today. Uh, so we went out to Shenandoah National Park in Virginia, and the uh, first one we went to was Luray Caverns. Um, it is the largest uh, cavern system in the eastern United States, and uh, it did not disappoint. Uh, you're in, this, in these massive, massive rooms. Um, a couple of takeaways, it's well lit, it's a self-guided uh, tour, walking tour. Um, so, because of all the lighting, your pictures and videos will come out pretty good. Um, very impressive. Some of the things you'll see are stalactites, the formations coming off the ceiling. Um, stalagmites, when they're coming from the bottom, eventually they'll connect and you got a column uh, of variations. And then, uh, uh, they call them drapes, so when you have wavy patterns, uh, huge formations. They have like many impressive ones. So you get drapes coming down. Um, sometimes when they're a little skinny and they have lines on them, they call them like bacon. Um, soda straws. So when these stalactites are really skinny and there's just one room that had like thousands of them from the ceiling. Uh, they call them soda straws because they're hollow inside. Uh, the last uh, formation is uh, called a shield and uh, it was really ironic but we learned about them when we went to Grand Cavern and that's in Grotto, Virginia. Um, that's like the opposite experience uh, where you didn't have like tons of people walking through like the subway. And so if you want the cave experience um, go to Grand Cavern. Uh, it was discovered in 1804, um, started doing tours in 1806, and uh, they're the oldest continually running show tour in the United States. So the guy tells us that you can see these uh, shield formations there, uh, there's like 200 of them they say, uh, whereas you might see one or two at other places, other caverns. So as the video goes on, check out those shields. Um, the video, that cave is really dark, um, so you're gonna get that humble, you know, uh, dark 164 feet in the ground cave experience that you will not get uh, in a well-lit room in like a uh, Luray. So uh, if you go, we, we all like that one better. If you go, just check it out. Those shields are beautiful. Uh, the drapes hanging off the shields. Um, actually, okay, so the shields are calcium formations. They're discs. They could be like a thousand, uh, sorry, like a ton. And uh, they grow off the wall. Sometimes they're off the ceiling. Uh, sometimes they also drop and so you'll, you'll see this huge uh, empty space on the, ceil the cavern ceiling uh, where they used to be. So uh, there's a lot to see. It's really a nice, humble feeling being in uh, Grand Caverns. Um, hope you liked the preview. Uh, like and subscribe. Go when you can. And uh, stay tuned for more CMR adventures. Let's get to the caves. Hey everybody, Anthony here. The CMR family is out in Virginia today and we're going to be visiting two wonderful underground limestone caverns filled with wonderful formations of stalactites and stalagmites. There's a backdrop right there of the mountains and we're going to be uh, starting with the Luray Caverns and then finishing off at Grottoes in uh, uh, Virginia with uh, the Grand Cavern. So check it out. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Beautiful little lake inside here. There's actually water still moving from the flow.
check out this section it's got like a thousand little stalactites soda straws there's even more coming down there's a huge column over here a little platform there and another huge column over there There's one large drapery here with a see-through, light in the back, we call it the bacon. We're right underneath a bunch of like 20 foot drapes. This is a huge drapery set. Big folds. Going all the way up top. That is phenomenal. Look at the one inside there. This is the one. Check out this beautiful color contrast right there. That is super cool. Then we got a bunch of drapes right here next to it. Man, double cool. Opens up to a huge cavern. Huge stalactites. So what we're looking at here in this dark image is a huge drapery set that's fallen over. And I guess it maybe continue to grow, but that's the bottom. That's where the top used to be. So that's pretty different. It's pretty cool. And it's sideways now. This one is called the glazed donut. Poor Alyssa. Right next to some really, really huge drapes. They're gigantic. It's a really big room. With some green algae on top. This is a giant room. Look at the color striations on this super tall stalactite column. Wow, this is the largest room I've seen. Okay. Who are we looking at? One, two, three.
ye old mining town. <laughs> See what they got here, a little sluicing thing for the kids. Buy a little bag of uh, stones and gems and sort through it. CMR and CMR Jr. taking a hike up to the uh, top of the trail there. We're going to enter the Grand Cavern. Hey look, we got some uh, other family you guys coming up the rear. Hey everybody, the CRMR family is out caverning this weekend or today. And we're our first stop is Grand Caverns in uh, Grotto, Virginia. So we're going to go check it out and go deep in the ground. Hey everybody, Krista Minor Rocks is doing Grand Caverns today in Grotto, Virginia. And uh, this is the first room. So there's a unique uh, formation called uh, a shield, and there's uh, about 200 of them in this particular cave system. And there's one right behind me. And it's got lots of these draperies formations right at the bottom. And so basically chunks of calcite growing together, giving that unique formation. Looks like we got another shield formation right there against the back wall. Some stalactites falling from that. This beautiful section, they call it the chandelier. We got one there and another one right there. Super cool. This is a really nice one right there. So intricate.
Wow, that's a pretty big shield piece here. So cool. All the draperies underneath it. Wow. Heading into the shield room. There's a multiple pieces here. Look at that. That is just super cool. Look at this gigantic uh, shield piece. They say it's about a, a ton each. Two blades of it. Wow, cool. And this one's got some draperies hanging out the back. It's starting to grow. Oh, wow. Look at these two shields also. That's what's different about this cave. Nice. This is the original opening of the Discovery Cave back in 1804. It's been expanded to let some light in and critters and bats. This is the spot.